Body Condition Score, or BCS for short, it's a technique you can use to assess your pet's body condition and it's calculated on a scale of 1 to 9. 1 is far too thin and 9 would be obese. Ideally, you would like your pet to have a body condition score between 4 and 5. Once the BCS has been calculated, then your pet's weight on the scales can be used to help track their progress and maintain them at their ideal condition. Throughout the process of determining if your pet's BCS is ideal or not, you should be asking yourself a series of questions. Firstly, can you see the ribs through the skin? Or when you place your hand on them, can you feel them or do you have to apply much pressure to find them? Next, looking from side on, does their abdomen tuck up towards their back legs or is it sagging? Finally, looking from above, is their waistline narrower than their chest or is it curved out? Ideally, your answer should be, no, the ribs are not visible under the skin. Yes, the ribs are easily felt under a thin layer of fat. Yes, the abdomen is tucking up nicely towards the hind legs. And yes, the waist is narrower than the chest. This chart is available on petmania.ie, so feel free to head across and use it to assess your own pet at home. The link is in the description. Don't leave the video just yet though. I'm going to show you how I carry out a body condition score assessment myself. Now, this is Susan, a nine-month-old domestic short hair cat. She's my helper for today's demonstration on how to assess her body condition score. Feeling along her ribs there, they can be felt without too much pressure, but there is quite a thick layer of fat covering them. So it's not a great start for Susan. If we look at her abdomen here from the side on, it is sagging a little bit. It should be tucking neater up here towards her back legs. And then with her waist, it should be narrowing behind the rib cage, but unfortunately for her, it's quite a straight line, if not curving out slightly. So Susan would be um, about a seven on the BCS scale.